Hey guys, I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here, one trailer at a time. Today, we're gonna look at a 2021 Solitude model number 346 FLS. It's a brand new floor plan from Grand Design. Uh, weighs around 14,400 pounds. It's a nice little shorter option, but for those people who still want that front living room, still got five slides, still got all those high-end amenities we want. Uh, let's buzz through the outside, have a look at the beautiful inside. First off, we got the new white exterior on this guy. Uh, so in years past, or even earlier this year, it was a beige finish. This is the new white stuff. Looks hot, looks good. This blue, guys, that we got on this Moride pin box. That shifts front to back three inches. This particular model has gen prep, which is what we got going on in here. And then our battery and box goes in there. Now we got six point hydraulic auto leveling, which you can see here with the round legs. We got 30 pound paint tanks, one on either side pass through storage it is a little bit limited right through here but we have a lot of storage in the back we're going to get to there's our controls for our six point leveling and then here's our docking bay uh our you know fresh water fill city water connection low points water filtration outside receptacle winterizing sanitizing outside shower all that done from in here nice and clean and it's heated off the furnace then we got our kitchen slide with our fridge vent in it Look at these nice tires, guys. We got Cooper tires. What size are these bad boys? 17. 17, thank you, Will. Uh, nitro fill, beauty looking rims, and then our Cray 3000 suspension to match the front pin box. Furnace vent, 12 gallon gas electric water heater, 50 amp service, detachable style cord. And this is where all the storage is, guys. Check this out. Boom. Flip this up. We got ourselves our good old fashioned mooring tray. Slide that out. Look at all that storage. Look how well this is finished off. It's all heated in from in here. We got ourselves a roof ladder. Get up on your roof, check your seals every 90 days. We got, what else we got, John? More storage. Outside speakers by Rockford Fosgate. More storage. Look at all of that, guys. That is wicked. Right on. Then we do have a more ride. Secure step that goes all the way to the ground. Lend a hand grab handle. One of the differences, guys, is the 382 or the 380 uh, solitude. They have the door right here in front of the kitchen slide. Now we got behind the kitchen slide, which I think is going to give us a little more access inside the trailer. Awesome. Let's have a look inside. Right on, guys. We're inside that solitude 346 FL. You're standing in the sunken in kitchen slash dining, and now you're looking forward into our front living room area. So come on up here, have a look at this. This is also the new cotton interior, this uh, new uh, new furniture we got going on here. Huge fan, I am a big, big fan of this. This is replacing the linen from last year. Very, um, just very light, uh, very modern looking. It doesn't feel like a leather, kind of feels like a, a mixture between like a, a jean, leather, fabric, very, very nice and comfy feeling. We got windows over on this side facing our campsite. We have our theater seats at the front, so this is a flip. We're used to seeing those back there and the TV here, but this is flipped from what they did with the 380 or the 382. Uh, looks good. I'm looking over my kitchen, uh, looking at like the, the, to the TV, which we're going to get to here. Very nice in through here. And then we do have a windshield in behind me here. Now, uh, in our other slide here, we have three more windows, which is awesome. We got trifold sofas here on both sides that are going to fold into you know queen size bed basically almost queen size beds. Uh, and then here's our fireplace with our crystal built in there, a Rockford Fosky sp speaker system, and then our televator is right here. All right, so that's gonna flip up. We're gonna bring it up the whole way here because I'm curious on something. All right. Doo -doo. Right on. So there's our TV right through there. I'm just wondering what's on the back side of this. We got ourselves a mirror, which is nice. Josh Allen has never met a mirror he didn't like. Um, right on, into the kitchen now. 18 cubic foot gas electric fridge. It is an option here to do a residential. Beside that fridge, we got some pantry space. Over here, we got a lot more pantry space. He's got adjustable shelves, some more storage there. And then our legit pantry right in through here with, again, more adjustable shelves and four pull-out drawers there. Now, um, over on this side here, 
This is different from the, the bigger front living room. Our oven is not in the slide. It's part of the stationary part of the trailer. We had great counter space on either side. Four burner stove top, big, deep insignia oven. Cover here around here with drawers built in. And then I bet you this is garbage. Yep, we got the double garbage action. Uh, or if you're environment conscious, you got recycling there. Storage, spot to hang up your keys. Some more storage there. More sport storage there. More storage there. I like how this is kind of backlit, making it nice and easy to see your stuff. Now, coming on this side, Will, I want you to get an idea of this island here. Um, we've just got some more cupboards, all right. Undermount stainless steel sink, all right, with a small division there at the bottom. And then we got our flip up counter extension here. Now, look how nice and flush that is, attention to detail. Now, over here, we've got another flip up, bingo bango, with six drawers here underneath. Okay, this could be a desk, this could be more counter space, whatever you want to do. We got a receptacle here, easy peasy. Now, what's also changed, guys, is they've upgraded the chairs. So they have these uh, lower backed fabric chairs. Uh, the steel legs are like the stationary legs, and the wood legs are the two folding ones. Again, door side windows looking out of our site, which is fantastic. Stationary table with a leaf that folds up, easy peasy. Now, looking back, this is another key to this floor plan that you have access here. When you, when you, when you walk in, you're not able to get to your fridge on the side of the road, but you are able to get to your washroom on the side of the road, which is a big bonus that most front living rooms don't have. Up into the washroom here, we got ourselves a porcelain toilet. Do your squat check. Feels good. Again, more solid surface here in the washroom. Storage down below. Drawers. Nice flat black uh, fixture there with a medicine cabinet here above. Now, into our shower. It's nicely sunken down and in, so my head's not even close to being in the skylight. Great space. We got this new teak seat where you can sit down and shave your legs. This uh, faucet is also been upgraded for the second half, of, uh, for the first half of 2021. It was like a a black kind of fixture. Now they got the body sprayer, they got the shower nozzle, they got the wand, they got all you need there. Spot to put your soaps right on. Now, it's an ensuite, so come on in through the, uh, through the washroom into the bedroom. This one has the, uh, the king bed, which is an option. It's on this particular model. We are gonna have some storage underneath this bed here. Good action over there. Jewelry tray and a pull out ottoman down below here. Right on. Now, <clears throat> We still got this wicked rear uh, closet with light up, with light going on. I can slide across. All right, nice and easy. Six big drawers here. Okay, and then we have our laundry in through there. All right, or if you're not using it for laundry, you can use it for whatever you want. Bedroom TV. It's on a little bit of a tilt facing the bed. Oh, we still got the lift up piece. That's nice. Right on. Cover. And then three more drawers. Nice bedside window or foot of the bed window facing your side as well. Awesome, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed that video. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel, share with your friends. You can email us here at sales at lazyacres.com or you can call us at 705-833-2539. Have a good day.